need the trolls to take this thing to Monument Island. Got her locked up in this place. Even in a restricted area, these crackers need someone to clean the floors. <laughs> Those politicians and scientists don't bother about what they say around me because I'm some half-leaded colored boy. But I can tell they scared out of their wits by that thing they got locked upstairs. Yes, sir. They got a tiger by the tail, and they don't know whether to hang on or run.
doing to her? Uh, Mr. Thompson, sir, I, I replaced the entire fuse banker's ass, and the lights were all in working order last night. Last night? There they go again. We go through boxes of fuses every day as of late, just in the siphon alone. I don't... Oh! oh some stuff is happening! What? Ah! Ah! It is one thing to imagine one's future, and another to see it. I have seen the seeds of fire that will prepare the Sodom below for the coming of the Lord. But Elizabeth shall sow those seeds, not I. I will fall before the job is done. But she shall take up my mantle. The Lord is calling me home. I feel his love in every tumor, because they are the train which takes me to his station. And I go with joy, knowing that Elizabeth will take my earthly place. But the false shepherd is coming to lead my lamb astray. I will not board that train until she is safe from his deceptions.
nothing to do with the job at hand. girl different. I suspect it has less to do with what she is and rather more with what she is not. A small part of her remains from where she came. It would seem the universe does not like its peas mixed with its porridge. My name is DeWitt. I'm a friend. I come to get you out get of here. Get away! Are you real? I'm real enough. He's coming. You, you've got to go. Why? You don't want to be here when he gets here. Just a minute, I'm getting dressed. I'll get you out of here. There's no way out. Trust me, I've looked. Stop it, you're, you're too impatient. That's enough. What about this? What about it? This is the way out, isn't it? What are you... Give it to me. See about that. Who are you? Why did you come here? This way, come on. Out of this tower.
school, Elizabeth. How do you know my name? Not now. Wait, let me try. Which way? of the living. Here, let me. I'll be fine. You almost drowned. You need to... I said I'm fine. Just... Just, just give me a minute. Do you hear that? Oh, it's music. You go on. I just... Oh. See that. Okay, I, I won't be long. I won't be long, Mr. DeWitt.
You see a young girl, a uh, blue skirt, no? No, but I'm without an escort if you're looking to pass the time. Hey, you see a young girl? Is this some kind of sales pitch? Because I'm not interested. You fellas seen a girl around here? A blue skirt, dark hair? <laughs> Look at this one. Why don't you just sleep it off, chum? Prophet may know how his own biography is going to end, but I can scarcely fathom how I'm going to start it. I mean, other than the kid stuff you get at the Hall of Heroes, anything prior to his baptism was, and here I quote, hang on, left on the riverside. They'll call me a plagiarist, but I'm going to spend the first 30 pages regurgitating scripture. Hey, I'm looking for a young girl. <laughs> ah, who isn't, brother? Airship. That could be our ticket out of here. Things rigged. All I want is fair pay for an honest day's work. anymore. Tell me about it. An Oriental stopped me on the street and asked me for the time. Just like that. There should be a law. I think there is. Maybe you and I should go for a walk along the shore. I'm not going on any walk with you. <laughs> Your reputation is well established. making trouble. Hmm. Look at him, ladies. It's a crime someone doesn't get him a nice set of trunks. <laughs> I'm gonna start shooting unless somebody else does. You're strong, strong. Move it. Come on, mister. We're working here. I'm going to marry you. I've heard that before. You have to believe me. 
I don't love her anymore. <sighs> it amazes me how many men I've met haven't the slightest idea who they really are. Tell my wife is scared, but I don't know how to comfort her. Comstock will take care of the fox. If he says he has a plan, then he has a plan. When has he ever let us down before? the Vox Populi do. Stir up the patties and the Negroes. First it's labor unrest, then they're coming for you in your bed. Comstock should stomp them out. All of them cockroaches. Doesn't get a say. With you, mother always gets a say. I'm my own man. <laughs> hey, miss it. Miss. Hey, miss. Miss Elizabeth. Hello. Oh, this is wonderful. Well, come dance with me, Mr. Dwight. I don't dance. Come on, let's go. Why? What can be better than this? Oh. How about Paris? Paris? How... I, I don't understand. How could we get there? That's where that airship's going, but if you want to stay and dance, we can... No, let's go. Come on, let's go. Come on, let's go right now. <laughs> Anything like that before, have you? Beaches I know don't smell much like that. Left. Now jump! Two, three, one, one. You're blocking the view. Mr. Duet, Comstock. I've read about him. They say he can see the future. Give a man a little power. He falls in all kinds of love with himself. I don't like his look. Do you dislike the look of the Prophet? Or his gaze? Can we leave now? It almost looks like a real ocean. It's just a set of elaborate pumps and rain catchers. <laughs> huh. That fall into the water did you no favors. I'll keep an eye out for something that might ease your pain.
Mr. DeWitt here. Bird. Or the cage. Or perhaps the bird. Nothing beats the cage. He's to it. How do Never mind. Look at these, they're amazing. Which one do you like more? This one or or this? The bird is beautiful and the cage is somber, but there's really something special about it. I just can't decide. <sighs> the one on the right. Are you sure? I'm sure. I love it. Surprising. I expected the cage. If you're going to be a sore loser, then I shan't do this again. Now that's just sophistry. Oh my god! My god! It has to be! Look! Are you alright? That was my home. We should get out of here. Let's go. the songbird when this happened. He'll set this right. He's the sword of vengeance. have a piece of photographic identification ready for presentation. Put those arms up now. Fingers apart. Legs apart. Stand still. Now hold steady. I ain't getting through there. I have just the thing. Come on. Come on. I don't see the point of stopping all of us just to find this one man. Did you hear about this statue? My god, what's happening? Well, they should just fumigate Finkton and be done with it. What is happening? Look at this one. Hey, hey, copper! Look at this one! He's suspicious, if you ask me! All right, all right, quiet down there, Pete. Just go home and dry yourself out. Damn thing's locked. What are you doing? You're a roguish type. What does it look like? Done. Where did you learn to pick locks? Trapped in a tower with nothing but books and spare time? <laughs> you would be surprised what I know how to do. take any task with more than the slightest complexity, or they simply leave it in ruins for me to clean up later. Oh, uh, hello, sir. Don't you pay me no never mind. Just some foolishness, you know. <laughs> Just monkey shines. On these silver eagles. There's a vending device over there. There might be something to bring you back to health. It's probably a good idea.
housekeeper acting suspicious? Try asking the girl a few key questions. Such as, don't you think those Vox Populi folk have a valid complaint against the Prophet? And, I'm sure some of your friends have attended meetings. I'd sure like to see what they're all about. Now, back to the music. Hey, mister. We'd like to help you. Do I know you? Back at the lottery, you... Without you, we wouldn't have gotten away. Daisy always said somebody like you would come along. Ain't no place for you, sir. You best be on your way, or there's gonna be trouble for us both. Can candy here. It's your can candy. What do you mean, not well? As in one stork, no husband. Hmm. She should disappear for a few months to Finkton, or some place like that, and then come back. No one would be the wiser. Come and take a photograph with the father of our country. He chopped down the cherry tree. He crossed the Delaware. On bended knee, he accepted the sword from the Angel Columbia. Come on, folks! Show your allegiance to flag and to the nation! To the sky, Comstock bent his knee and saw with holy prophecy an Eden floating in the mist by man forsworn, by heaven kissed. Hey, Mr. DeWitt! Wallace Flintlock! It's the newest one in the series. I read it was delayed three times. Comstock will take care of them. I don't know. Why is one bathroom for colors and the other for lights? It just is. Seems like an unnecessary complication. Need money? Okay. Got it. Intend for me to 
follow you in there. As a boy, I had a dog named Bill. Like all dogs, Bill was a loyal friend. If we had not fed him, Bill... Are you all right in there? Everything's fine. Bill would have been loyal. Only when the colored man can make that claim will he take his place in society. Are you trying to get us both arrested? to find out you're running around planting kisses on all the girls. But little Mary McCarthy and that horrid Erin O'Malley, if your father found out, oh, it is bad enough he has to employ those potato eaters. <laughs> oh, Frederick, you leave me in such a state. She's working, is she? Yes, at a newspaper. <laughs> That's the modern woman, I suppose. Doesn't make it right. Annabelle? Excuse me? Annabelle? Cat. It's me, Esther. Oh, no, I'm not Annabelle. Are you sure? My name is Elizabeth. Do I know you? Elizabeth? Isn't that a lovely name? <laughs> that was... odd. Last customer. Park's closing. Park's closing, everyone. Yeah, these shoes sure could benefit from a shine. I guess I haven't paid much attention. Looks like rain. Better rain than snow. I suppose that's true. Hmm. Hey, you wanna watch out? I just swapped that. Sauerkraut? Sauerkraut? Uh, I guess so. I'll take, um, one, please. How much? Um, one silver eagle. <laughs> All right. Excuse me. I don't know. I suspect he's carrying hey. something. He's 
with her. Hey! Sure. We can get both out. Two tickets for passage to the First Lady airship? Yeah, just a minute, friend. Yeah, I have it. How do you, uh, want to proceed? In a bit of a rush, pal. Hey, mister. You're gonna get lost mm -hmm. all over your nice suit. I got it. I'll ring you back once the matter's in hand. I don't like this. Yeah, send in the bird. We're ready to execute. Stay where you are! Move in! What are you doing? Get the girl! Don't move. Get off of me! Elizabeth! Out! Stay away from me! Surrender! You'll die here! After him, now! Oh. better already. Ah! <sighs> 
when you did that. They're all dead. You killed those people. Elizabeth. You're a monster. What did you think was going to happen? Hmm? What? Do you understand the expense the people went through to keep you locked up in that tower? You think people like that are just going to let you walk away? You are an investment. And you will not be safe until you are far away from here. What, what do they want from me? I don't know. One thing I've learned. If you don't draw first, you don't get to draw at all. You're bleeding. Come here. <sighs> what happened back there? <sighs> it's not the last of it, is it? I don't know. There. I best get used to it. You know, I've read a thing or two about medicine. I'll do my best to keep you supplied with remedies. And if your wounds are deeper, I'll try to keep you on this side of the abyss.